Hi there, it's Gabrielle Nicolay from Speech Kids. I'm a speech therapist who teaches little kids to talk and helps parents understand their little kids. And we've been talking about curiosity. And so today we're talking about three-year-olds and curiosity. Um, and you will have noticed that your three-year-old is um, pretty independent at this point. Um, they should be fairly uh, easily able to translate their thoughts into words and tell you exactly what they're thinking, uh, for better or for worse. And they are asking a lot of questions, notably why. Why this? Why that? Why everything? And so um, depending on where the why is, um, why, why the why is coming up, you're going to want to answer the question that was asked and not read too much into um, the background that your adult mind might really feed into. Um, and so if your child is asking you, why, why, we, why do we take a bath? You might just say, because it's time um, and not launch into a whole thing about personal hygiene. Um, if your child asks you, and this is a big one, um, why somebody else's skin is darker or lighter than yours or hers or his, you might just say, because people are different shades. Now that's a whole other conversation. But again, at this age, at the age of three, where kids are really sort of um, noticing and classifying things and wanting to know cause and effect, and they're asking why, answer the question that was asked. And no more. Um, and that is your tip for fostering curiosity in threes. No question should be off limits. Um, it's just the amount of information that you present might be different depending on your child, depending on the reason they're asking. And um, just creating that, continuing to create that container for understanding the world. Until next time, take care. Bye-bye.